What is going on everybody? Captain Blue Shell coming to you guys today after a long, long time from making a video of World of Warships. We are back guys. It feels good to be back in the captain's chair. And today something different, something awesome to be looking forward to. Wargaming has introduced us to Rubber Ducky Warfare, guys. We are going to be battling some rubber duckies in a giant tub. <laughs> it just, it's so silly, it's so awesome, and we just, we have to do it. We have to try it out. I saw it kind of play out, and I'm not really sure how well we're going to do, but it's rubber duckies, you gotta love it, so stick around. It's Captain Blue Shell. Well, 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 if it isn't Captain Blue Shell. Here we go, guys. I don't know if you're ready. I don't even know if I'm ready, but let's go ahead and just take a uh, take a look at the... <laughs> that's amazing. It's freaking Zorro. It's... Oh my god, that's... That's... Oh, that's incredible. Just because I truly love the Zorro, you know, the Zora-esque, you know, movement. This on a rubber ducky. I have to get this as a rubber ducky at some point in my life. Oh my goodness. <laughs> We've got Quackaducko. I really like this too as well. And then... McQuatchy. <laughs> Luigi McQuatchy. <laughs> this is gonna... Something tells me that this is gonna be absolutely phenomenal. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna do the uh, the little Zorro rubber ducky. Let's go ahead and get into the battle, guys. Oh, this loading screen. Oh my god, look. I mean, obviously, we've got Terminator, you know, right above us here. And that's as amazing as it gets right there. This one, I'm trying to think. I thought it was like a Clint Eastwood... But uh, I really love these variations of of just rubber duckies. My webcam just failed, but oh my god, guys, I I absolutely love this. It's probably better that we just have gameplay anyway. Oh no, I I think I'm slowing down because of these guys' things. There is so much mayhem going on in this tub, and I absolutely love it. It's like it's such a beautiful like little mayhem of rubber duckies everywhere. I am. <laughs> this is like this is such a blast. Like, I know you guys don't want to see my ugly face getting in the way of such awesome mayhem. <laughs> this is fun, though. Like, this is this is actually a whole lot of fun. This is... <laughs> it's just, it's so silly, it's so out there, but at the same time, rubber duckies is what we need. It's what we need in these games. <laughs> in this game. <laughs> oh no, are we gonna hit it? Barely, barely. Close call, close call. Let's see if I can get this guy. Yes! We sink their rubber ducky. Heck yeah. Oh no! Now we're down too. I really want to see how the ducks sink though. So we basically just kind of topple over here to our doom. <laughs> it's funny because I lost and at the same time, I'm not really even that upset at all. It's just like slowly seeing your, <laughs> slowly seeing your rubber ducky just kind of... <laughs> drift away <laughs> but yeah i mean if we zoom out and look around everything the bathtub all of the toys there's even a bird look there's even a bird outside the window of our of our hot tub bath and, and just like absolutely pandemonium just going on the huge fish down there the huge cat oh my god look at this this is freaking the crap out of me guys the cat just kind of staring at you this is amazing. Like, this is... This this gives me a little bit more respect with Wargaming, I have to say. I'm really hoping our team wins. This is like a uh, little destroyer duck coming on here, too. I don't know. He's going to try to... He's going to try to hide behind the carbonated beverage. I almost said a, uh, a copyrighted... Copyrighted company there. That would not have been good. But yeah. Look, our cruisers are attacking him. We've got... Uh, <laughs> the Ouija Quacks. <laughs> I, I forget the names, but this is this is phenomenal. Come on, come on, dude, get him, get him. Oh no! Watch out for the little ducky torpedoes. And he bonked into the uh, the hammerhead shark there. So I guess when you bonk, you kind of just bounce like back a ways or something. Kind of throws you off. Let's see if we can go ahead and finish him off. I'm hoping at least our team will come up with a win, with a rubber ducky win. Our very first rubber ducky win. I think this guy might get him. Destroyer versus destroyer, I don't know. It's gonna be a close call. 
Oh, they're closing in on him. Towards the submarine, he's gonna bounce off of there. Boing, he bounced. I think he dodged the torpedoes that were coming after him. Uh-oh, uh-oh. The ducky's in trouble. Ducky's in big trouble, guys. Oh, snap, that really quacks me up. Sorry, sorry, I'm sorry with the puns. I'm sorry, okay, I'm sorry. Oh snap, I guess that's it. I guess that's gonna be the end of the match. I guess he exploded, but we did not detect. Ladies and gentlemen, foul play. Be sure to like and subscribe. Sorry, I lost my webcam there, guys. This is probably an improvement to you, and uh, I don't blame you, really. I really don't. Now you don't have to see my face, but if we take a look, I really love how they divvy these up. Like, uh, battleships, you've got this as your cruiser for El Makwachi. And then also, too, as the uh, destroyer, which we completely, uh, <laughs> we just, we just completely ruined it, is, uh, the Don de la Doc. <laughs> I'm gonna give it one more go as a battleship, uh, just to kind of check and see how this really fights in a huge hot tub with a cat staring right at us. I think it should go, you know, pretty smooth. I like playing the battleships. It's a little bit more comfortable, being that it's this, you know, this long since I made a World of Warships video, which I need to get back into. We should do all right, hopefully, with the battleship. I also love how it's divvied up into, like, the teams, like this on one side, this on the other side, and you just kind of, like, go at it. Everybody's just kind of, I don't know, it's kind of like a free-for-all, but at the same time, if you lose, you can't really help but to smile, right? I mean, this is definitely a, it's a game mode to just smile about and to have some, you know, have some fun. I don't know what that is down there. Is that a tablet down there? It's nothing of a reflection. That's crazy, though. I will admit it's hard to tell right off the bat as to what ducks are, you know, like what. I mean, like, you know, obviously we know if they're cruisers or, oh crap, that was a complete fail. We know if they're cruisers, destroyers all that good stuff. It's just kind of hard to tell at first what duck is what, and then you kind of got to read, oh, okay, this one is that kind, this one's that kind, just from the logo up above. Let's go ahead and try to uh, get this guy. He just bonged a ways away. Come on. Keep going up a little bit more. There we go. Come on, buddy. That was a good hit. That was a good hit. Come on. Gonna try to, uh, try to avoid. Nope, we're not gonna avoid any of those. Let me go ahead and go back on over here. It's a good thing I told you guys it's been a long time since I've played this. <laughs> there is one guy that we are going to try to target. It's gonna be this cruiser. See if we can finally get him. Get our guy. Come on. Should we ram him? We'll try to ram him. I can't ram him. That sucks. There we go. We got, uh, we got some speed now. Now that I've figured out the speed, this guy is about to go. Where did he go? Oh my god. No. 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 <laughs> no. Somebody took my kill because I bounced off of a... What is it? A turtle? <laughs> I'm just trying to get used to everything, like all the controls and everything, though, too. We are about to lose this battle. Oh, crap. Okay, so that's how I... Okay, at least we're learning. All right, guys, one last one. We're going to be doing Luigi Makwachi. <laughs> it's, uh, this one's going to be the cruiser, so we can go ahead and do all three. Uh, there's a lot to, I mean, it's just a lot to kind of remember because you also have, uh, you know, your placements with the torpedoes. It's basically just like a regular ship game, but there's so much going on because it's so close quarters. And you also have to watch out because if you hit something, you just kind of bounce back away from it and also too it's just like putting down the mines you know trying to get other duckies to get into your mines and kind of disrupt them as much as you can there's that huge fish up there i didn't even know that he could surface 
But that's just, I mean, this is just all kinds of crazy business, baby. Oh crap, our destroyer, okay. I was gonna say, if our destroyer gets hit and killed by, you know, torpedoes, that's not a good thing. It's not a good thing at all. Where? So I'm guessing we're just gonna be heading straight on through. We don't want to do it too much. We don't want to give them broadside or anything. But let's go ahead, just kind of rendezvous with these guys. Yeah, another... I love I love how your head tracks to where you're actually pointing to as well. This is, <laughs> this is such an awesome little feature, like a little detail. I love it. All right, well, that guy's taken care of. Can we hit this guy without hitting our own guy? I don't know. Gotta make sure nobody's sneaking up on us. Nope, we're good. Our map looks all right. Oh, there's a guy, there's a guy, there's a guy. Come on. Uh-oh, oh no, we're gonna hit. Ah, we hit into the floating McBody thingy. Come on, oh, uh-oh. I'm not entirely sure, but I don't think our weapon is really hitting all that well. There we go. Okay, we got a couple of hits on him. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna be putting my mines down here too as well in just a second. I'm just kind of getting this straightened out here. There we go. All right, are we ready? Here we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put down, I'm gonna put down the mines here in just a second. There we go. And now we're taking some Hits and hinges from that other cruiser there, too, as well. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, crap. We're going to hit. Oh, there it goes. Sinking down into the depths of the water. Because we were well, we were either shot down or we went into the mine. So, hoping my mines are going to do some good, too. Hey, we got a kill. Heck, yeah, baby. Late kill, but a kill is a kill. I'm glad somebody went into my mines and kind of blew up. Even though... We're gonna lose this battle. What a lot of fun. This is just, I mean, this is creative. It's imaginative. I really appreciate it. And it's just, it's just having fun in World of Warships once again. I will give Wargaming this, okay? They do have quite a bit of creativity. If they want to, they can make the game as creative, as fun loving as they want to. And I really do think that they look after their player base in that respect. You know, I, I really think that they, they come up with, you know, some genius little, you know, just like fun little details like this. You know, overall, I mean, they don't have to, but they do it anyway. And, uh, you know, I, I have an appreciation for that sort. So it's been fun with the rubber duckies, even though here we go with the, uh, the last, wait, where's our last destroyer? I can't even find him. He's so stealth, not even I know where he is. There he is. He's behind the, uh, the plastic boat. He's the lone ranger of the duckies, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, this guy, well, this guy knows what he's doing. This guy knows exactly what he's doing. Look at that. Pooping out them green mines. <laughs> but obviously, the law is going to catch up to you, little Zorro duck. As it always does, my friend. Somebody will be there to avenge you. I don't think he really cares. He knows that he knows his time is limited. But, I mean, look at the bathtub itself. Everything, everywhere around, all the toys, all the obstructions, all the little floaty McBouncy. <laughs> and there it is. There we go, guys. So what do I think? I think that this is probably my favorite battle type that they've ever had. Just the rubber ducky madness. It's great. The bathtub, the theming. And also, too, since we don't have my webcam, we can actually take a look down here. Even more description. Don de la Duck. <laughs> Don de la Duck comes from a wealthy and influential duck dynasty whose history has been closely interwoven with Fishy since her very birth. This is just so cool. And it's like it's like that for each one. You know, Special Drake Forces operative Quack Ducko has retired from Cap's elite unit and leads a preceding life as a model family duck. And then even Luigi Maquachi, high speed and firing rate, a mastery of high explosive, Bubbles and mines. That's what Luigi McQuachi was famous for in the Police Academy. It's like they put so much detail into these. 
I really do appreciate it. I've had so much fun with this battle type. It's it's just it's it's almost addictive. It really is. It's fun. It's exciting. It's silly. It's creative. If you guys want to check it out, definitely go ahead for it. I say to do it. It's it's a lot of fun. It's a nice, you know, use of time for just smile and laughs and giggles. And uh, I'm glad that I tried it out with you guys. And so definitely, for more videos like this, follow, like, subscribe. I will see you on that next beautiful rubber ducky, <laughs> rubber ducky video. <laughs> it's Captain Blue Shell. I'm out.